I want to do a very quick update on my grafted seedlings and you can see I put them in the big pot look how much they grow it's all the, all the way to the top so this one is uh, our Agus baby pollinated with the American Beauty pollen and all the other three are Kathy Vanna June pollinated with um, Trisha's pollen as you can see they're both growing pretty well but if you think this one growing fast I'm going to show you some surprise this one I showed it uh, before on um, uh, update on May so this this is a grafting point these are grafted on uh, established Vietnamese white on uh, uh, May, I show you there was just a start to show a successful grafting. But look how much they grow. They have one, two, three, four, five branches come out from that one point, and each of them growing very, very strongly, very nice. And the interesting thing is, you can see the thorns at the base, the thorns are very big. I go towards the end, the thorn getting smaller and smaller. It's not as big anymore. The thorn is the one I try to see, try to use as a character characteristics of a Kathy. But now I'm not too sure anymore. These these thorns are much smaller than Kathy uh, thorns. And after that, I grafted another two, one here and one there. And look at what have I found. If that looks like a flower bud, that looks very much like a flower bud. But this one is just only that little from there to there. And this happened on this big one too. From here, I spotted something very similar to that is a little flower bud but they didn't take it they kind of absorbed back and uh, this one's already show sign of yellowish I don't think they can they will make it but it's just amazing tiny little seedings grafted on established dragon fruit can show flower bud so early so that's one I want to show before the flower bud absorb it back. I don't think this one can survive. So and also I want to talk about um, this um, this one. This is a Asunda 4. Asunda 4 is a very good one. They growing very fast. I was uh, this one was start from yes last year and uh, about the 18 months they already start the fruit and flower and you can see the fruit it's pretty big it's bigger than all other purple flower dragon fruit like a Connie Mayer, a Bruni or Kathy Van Arun this is at least twice big and um, the, pro the problem is their flowering um, defect I have over I think it's 12 flowers from this uh, soon before but they only got three fruit from this set of 12 flowers because the flower don't open so even I force them to open to pollinate it or the one I force opened um, didn't take it so they had to be naturally opened a little bit and you, you can uh, force them open bigger to pollinate in order to set fruit and also I want to show one more thing that um, here I have uh, several different um, Asunda 4 is all from the same one so like this one I only start from that little pieces it's at the start from very very small cuttings and also have some start from grafting grafted uh, Asunda 4 and both like, like this one like this one is from the grafted Asunda 4 
but this one is from this tiny little it's the one growing up from the tiny little cuttings so they seem to both flowered and fruit at the same time I thought that was interesting so no matter how small the pieces is they can still fruit very quickly as the wine grafted so um, that's the one I think that's uh, the one I want to update and uh, you see this beautiful fruit that's a uh, seen Spanish although it's a very pretty fruit but it's not very sweet uh, last year we'll see how it goes this year and also you can see my flora is uh, very good flowering also over there there are the two flora there right there there. It's very good, and then even this tiny little graphite are very very small pieces. The floral graphite is very small pieces. The root stock. They also almost every one of the end has a flower, but this flower is really very productive. Very very good. Very nice. And that's it. Thanks for watching.